to high school sports. The Inner City Volleyball Tournament is a two-day, four-match tournament to earn Twin City bragging rights. The title match, Normal U-High taking on Bloomington Central Catholic. U-High's Lola Clayton to Mo Pedlin for the kill right there. Bloomington Central Catholic go a nice up in the back here by Addison Hennigus. It sets up the kill by Campbell Kneepagan. Then Lauren O'Brien to Rosie Krenz. And Central Catholic had the lead in set one, but U-High would rally on set point Emma Jean Lanen to Amanda Freehill. And Freehill gets it down for a win for U-High 26-24 in set one. Set two, U High's rolling. Alyssa Wolf is going to get a block. And the normal U High Pioneers, your undefeated inner city volleyball champs. I mean, we're very lucky to have in town good rivalry. Um, we have very good teams that we're lucky to play against. Um, we knew that we really had to come out and play our best against all four teams, but yeah, we were just excited. Congratulations to normal U High. Normal Community finishes in second place. Their libero Maya Blumenstein is going to set up Olena Whitfield for a pretty little tip right here. A later Whitfield is going to drive one through the block and down for a normal community point. What a terrific player she is. Bloomington's going to get a tip by Emma Crocker right here. A little tip over the defense. But Normal Community's winner, Olivia Garriott's to Sydney Jansen. Great tournament for the Lady Iron. Normal West bounced back today. The Wildcats suffered their first two losses of the year Saturday. This tournament is dynamite. They were in trouble tonight versus Bloomington Central Camp. Campbell Neath taking the big swing, but Ellie ranked the block for Normal West. Then Laney Thompson sets up Eden Hofferman, and Hofferman's going to get a big hit here for the Cats and really fired him up. Later, it's Asaya Blanks with the block. A great win today for Normal West. Now to soccer. Peoria Christian playing at Eureka tonight. The Chargers playing Roanoke. Benson Eureka. Peoria Christian such a great passing team. Watch the uh, teamwork here. Jacob Walton to Truth Creighton. Creighton sends it ahead to Colson Below, and Below says 1-0. He scores the first goal of the game. Later it's going to be Mac Nicholson on the shot. Number eight eventually is going to get a shot here. It's going to be knocked in by Jacob Walton for a goal on the header. Orono Benson Eureka's Landon Martin scores and the crowd goes wild. The crowd goes wild. They were pretty in pink tonight, that crowd. Uh, but the crowd was pretty quiet after that beautiful assist right here by the assist merchant, Quentin Hennick. The back heel pass to Truth Creighton. Jory Christmas is a winner tonight, 9-1. to one. Time now for our Monday Night Football tradition. Time for Monday Rewind. Football Friday, week five. How about a high five to Farmington? They go to 5-0 and oh, thanks to five touchdown passes by Lane Wheelwright. It was remarkably windy on Friday, but you couldn't tell. Three of those touchdown passes going to Jack Roanwald. Bloomington set a school record with 84 points in their game at Urbana. Mikey Kimball scores. Things will be tougher this week when they play normal community. Metamore's J. Don Cranford. Look at the stop and go. Stop, go. Look at that little jump cut and then a little, little nifty little finish here for J. Don Cranford. Is he fun to watch? And A.J. Jones of Washington's got those same nifty moves. Look at these moves. He's got limestone rockets tackling air. Tackling air. Having fun right there. That is Football Rewind for Week 5.